I started the day as usual with a Robusta shot of coffee. It's a Robusta bean I've been messing around with from Ecuador for the past month or two, trying to run some experiments, collecting a little bit of data. So this is just a single basket overpacked to 14 and a half grams. And I ended up with like an 18% extraction yield. And it's running over a cooling rock as well, so I'm cooling it very quickly. And after the shot, I've been drying the grounds to compare the um, extraction yield versus the measured extraction yield, which I've previously done with Arabica, but I wanted to check that it was the same effect with Robusta. So then this is a, a staccato shot, again with the experimental data set, or sorry, not experimental data set, it's experimental coffee processing set from Chromatic Coffee. Um, so it's still coming out one-sided. I started tweaking the profile to put in a, um, a, a pause that's different than a normal pause because it seems like the major channeling occurs when I slow the flow down after the initial flow. But I'm still working with uh, very low pressures. So there's a big channel in the middle. Um, so I'm still at a very low pressure. I'm not, I don't even get above two bars. And afterwards in the puck, there's a large chunk that's not extracted. Then I went to trying to sift with a single screen. So I started with 800 micron screen and I switched to 600 micron because 800 micron was sifting everything too fast. And so using a single screen, the first part that comes out should be finer than the second part and the third part based on what I found from sifting as usually when you sift with a single screen, the finer particles come out first. So as expected, the shot uh, does look like a regular sifted staccato shot and it had a similar extraction yield and taste profile as the time I, I sifted it with uh, two screens, like normal. Um, and it looked pretty good. And the sifting was a lot faster, so I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to make sifting faster and more accessible to more people. So that's the day.